It's an absolutely cracking day up here in the um, Adelaide Hills on a little feeder stream and uh, we're in the middle of winter. Um, it's a great time to get out on the stream and see um, what fish have run up from the main river and are spawning. In this little stream, uh, the early run around May and early June is um, mainly brown trout and then later on there may be a few rainbows. We're right at the top end of the creek today, but um, there are fish around. I've seen a couple this morning. Uh, we're going to drop down, look at the mid-sections and try and find some gravel reds where fish may actually be uh, on the reds and um, laying their eggs. We've had a little bit of rain, the river's lifted a little bit. It's always a good opportune time for them to then run out of the main river and come up and find a good clean bit of gravel. As you'll see in this video, you'll probably be uh, seeing some fish vying for position, mainly the males will get behind the female and they'll actually try and get in to uh, lay their milk over her eggs as she's spawning. There's a bit of jostling and a bit of moving around and um, always a great thing to watch on the stream because um, a lot of us don't get set, but we're not, we're not fishing at this time of year, but there's still a lot of activity on the river. So um, let's hope we find some today and um, hopefully you'll enjoy. Thank you. It's a healthy sign to, to look down on this little stream and see so many fish that are um, up from the main river and uh, spawning. It's um, particularly encouraging given the year that um, we just had. The summer was incredibly hot and um, it's quite amazing that uh, this little spring fed stream has, has hung on to once again give life to trout um, for future seasons. Freshly cleaned reds are um, very obvious where fish have been um, basically stirring up the, uh, the silt to get clean gravel and um, to lay their eggs. Um, this is a prime example here. You can see how there must have been fish working here probably in the last couple of weeks um, and they've cleaned all that gravel where they've um, uh, just basically um, vibrated their bodies against the bottom and that's shifted the silt off it, allowing nice, clean, fresh, oxygenated uh, gravel in which to lay their eggs.